Hey guys, I uh, wanted to check out what kind of cable the USB-C um, cable it came with the Framework 16. You know, the one with the 180 watts uh, power supply. And according to this USB tester, it looks like the e-chip is saying 50 volts, 5 amps, which is 250 watts, which is more than what, um, you know, they said this is rated for, which is supposed to be, uh, you know, 240, according to this. However, I'm kind of wondering, you know, the, since this spec hasn't been um, available when this tester came out, I'm kind of wondering if it's a false, um, a false reading, but I don't know. But it was interesting to find out anyways. Um, but not only that, but it's good to know that the speed that it works with is only USB 2.0. So, <laughs> I was hoping that it would also double as a Thunderbolt 4 or USB 4 cable, but, um, well, then again, it might still, because, again, this was, this tester was created before USB 4, um, but that's a good, uh, good way, uh, good thing, thing good thing to test as well. Um, so let's check it out. All right. I now have it connected to a uh, NVMe SSD drive. So let's see how fast this test sat. Oh, hold on. Did it go? Oh wow, look how slow that is. Yep, USB 2.0 speeds, it didn't lie. <laughs> We're looking at 44.3 megabytes per second. Average read about 30 megabytes per second. Write speeds. Wow. And it's still going. I'm not going to make you guys wait for this, but okay, well, good to know. The USB-C cable that comes with the 180-watt charger, which can do 240 watts, is a USB 2.0 cable. Best it can do. So I'm really doubtful that you can use this one as a Thunderbolt or USB 4.0 cable. <laughs> Thunderbolt 4, Thunderbolt 3, and USB 4, those are off the table. So it does look like it's just USB 2.0 is the max. But while it's great because it's the only cable I have that can do high wattage uh, charging that's over 100 watts, so this does cover all the way up to 240 watts when those chargers finally exist. Um, but for now, it does 180 because that's what I've got. And the cable can do 240. But it's not going to be the best for data transfer. At least data is working. It's just, um, it's a USB 2 uh, cable, basically, is all it can do. But um, hey, good to know. That is all. Short video today. Bye.